Send up to heaven, right? Anything we do, it has to be done by the power of the Spirit. Amen. 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 Because it's God that works in us yes. to do His will. Amen. Amen. And it's good place. But He said, then He said, and whatever I want you to do, do all things without murmuring. Without yes. murmuring and disputing. He said, if you're going to be doing it grudgingly and complaining, mm -hmm. the number one thing when you ask tell people that they're supposed to give their 10%, People say, well, I paid my time. You ain't never paid God nothing. That's just right. Say that. Let's just straighten that out right now. Say that. Well, I paid my, you ain't paid God nothing. Come on, man. Because everything we have, including our breath, belongs to God. That's right. And if you don't believe me, every time, try to control that. When he calls, you're going to answer. Amen. Amen. You're going to answer. There's going to be no call waiting. Call forward. <laughs> I know. Amen. You're not going to just hang up. No. <laughs> you know, it's funny. I, I, I saw a little bit of a movie the, uh, the other day called Final Destination. Uh-huh. You know, and they call it stuff cheating death. Mm -hmm. And the man told him, you can't cheat death. No, you you lost your mind. No, you can't. You can't cheat death. No. When the time comes, you die. Amen. They go for all of us. Amen. First and thing. That ye may be blameless oh, yes. and harmless, yes. the sons of God, yes, yes. without rebuke, mm -hmm. in the midst of a crooked and perverse nation, mm -hmm. among yes. whom ye shine as lights in the world. Yes. We're Amen. supposed to be lights yes. Yes. in a dark world. Yes. We're not people supposed to look at it. We're not supposed to look like the world. Mm -hmm. They're supposed to see something different. Amen. Amen. We're supposed to act different. Talk different, deal with things different. So they said, man, what are you doing? How did you do that? Jesus. Amen. Like the Philippians said, I need him. Amen. How do I get him? What must I do Amen. to be saved? Amen. He said, you must believe in the Lord Jesus. Amen. He said, you'll be saved and your household. Yeah, amen. amen. But I'm, I'm, I'm going to share some things with you. Sometimes we say, I can't believe I had to wait. 30 minutes an hour for my food. You ever did that? You go to the restaurant and you just wait and be like, man. Amen. Amen. Thank God you got some money to go to the restaurant. Amen. Amen. Get a meal, okay? Amen. 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 I'm going to tell you why. Because today, this is a, a true statistic. More than 27,000 children will die from a malnutrition today. Amen. Every day. More than 27,000 children all over the world die because they ain't got no food. Amen. Amen. Some of you might have said, I don't know what I'm going to do if my parents don't buy me that new iPhone. <laughs> hey, y'all, listen. Parents that try to take the kids' phone and got killed now. <laughs> I was just watching something the other day, uh, 2020. And uh, the, the, the two twin girls, they was happen to be uh, uh, black girls. They stopped the police and said somebody killed my mom. They went in the house. Mama had been stabbed 50 times and drugged and put in the bathtub. Now they feeling sorry for these girls. I was too. I'm like, oh my God, that's horrible. The girl mama came down, she got the grandkids, she crying, she feeling up. They looking for the person to kill. Mm -hmm. And you know when they start investigating, they start looking at cameras and different stuff. So the girls was lying. Yeah. They said they went to school, they didn't go to school. Mm -hmm. They look at them cameras, they got in the car with some man, right? Mm -hmm. So they called them back in, they said something's not adding up. Y'all need to they kept on lying. Mm -hmm. Come to find out them girls killed their own mom. She tried to take their phones. No, one hit in the head with a lamp and the other one stabbed oh, 50 Jesus. times. Oh, and then lied about it. No. Y'all, that is demonic activity. Yes, yes, yes. People burning their babies, killing their babies. Yes, Another one, a young a man killed his wife and they couldn't prove it because they didn't have a body. No. Then they took his two little boys but they gave him visitation rights. Okay? The girl, the lady took the boys to the house. He slammed the door and locked it and cut their head off. And then burned the house down. And they sued the uh, 
Child Protective Agency. No. Okay? Mm -hmm. For like $189 million. Mm -hmm. And they won the lawsuit. Because mm -hmm. they said they should have never let them kids go back to that man. Mm -hmm. They won. Your money, activity. Okay? So we, 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 we can't be murmuring and complaining about stuff we don't know about. Amen. So they said, well, I don't know if my parents going to buy me that cell phone, uh, but be thankful that you have at least one parent. Amen. 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 Half the world lives on less than $2 a day. That's nearly 3 billion people. Nearly 3 billion people in this world live on less than $2 a day. Mm -hmm. In poverty ridden countries. You see what I'm saying? We sport. We don't have a clue. Amen. 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 We don't have a clue. Amen. Amen. If I don't get a raise this year, if I don't get a raise this year, by the end of this year, I'm quitting. <laughs> yeah, if I don't, they don't give me a raise, they don't know my words. I just, okay. <laughs> Worldwide, there's over one billion people who don't have a job, that want a job. I'm not talking about now the people who don't want a job, but people who want a job. The preaching was too long. And the music was too loud today in the church. Oh, mm -hmm. bring it home. Mm -hmm. You ever said that? I have. Mm -hmm. Amen. Oh yeah, I have. When I was, when I was just a uh, church member. Amen. And I wasn't in Christ. I was just in the church. Mm -hmm. yeah. I said it all the time. Mm -hmm. Amen. Yeah. <laughs> Billions of people on this planet today yeah. cannot worship God. Mm -hmm. Not without losing their life. Mm -hmm. They want to. And here in America, we can do it at our leisure. No. Right now. That's kind of what we want. People won't even come. People won't even do it. But you'll pay money that you don't even have to go see somebody you don't even know. Right, man. Say that. Sing some songs you don't even like. <laughs> we need some help. Amen. We need help. Amen. We got some mental problems. Amen. Amen. And when something happened to you, I want you to call LeBron James and see if he'll give you some money for your baby's cancer. Okay? Don't call on Jesus. Don't go, don't oh my God, OMG, because that's what you're gonna do. Mm -hmm. See, we're not calling on none of them people when we need help. Same. Real help. Amen. We call on the one that we know can really help us. Amen. Amen. But we only do that when we feel like we need it. Amen. But you need him every day. Amen. 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 Let me tell you why God told us so many times in the Bible to be thankful. Yeah. Have some gratitude. You know, an uh, attitude of gratitude. Yes. Amen. You know, yes. It's why gratitude and giving thanks is the number one weapon God gave us to defeat depression, mm -hmm. anxiety, and fear. Yeah. Amen. True. It is the cure to disappointment, mm -hmm. yes, it is. guilt, mm -hmm. and regret. Amen. 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 That's why he said be thankful. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm going to tell you why. David had more problems in his life, I'm talking about King David, mm -hmm. than we'll ever face in our life. Mm -hmm. All together, collectively. Right. Right. You will never deal with the problems he dealt with. Mm -hmm. He made mistakes. He, he sinned against God. We know the story. Oh, yeah. Probably the only thing you remember about him is Bathsheba. Oh. <laughs> Amen. You don't know nothing about David except Bathsheba. Yeah. But he's still the apple of God's eye. Amen. Amen. He had regrets. Mm -hmm. But he learned how to overcome all of those things. Yes. Amen. Amen. By keeping Amen. God's word. Amen. The reason people struggle in the world today is they don't want to keep God's word. Mm -hmm. Amen. You'll read it, you'll know it, you'll quote it, you'll everything, but you won't keep 
Amen. Well, the blessing only comes when you keep. Amen. 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 Now look, Psalm one nineteen one o five. David wrote, "Now word is what a lamp to my feet and a light to my path." That text is one of the most important texts in Scripture. Because without the Word of God, you're walking around, stumbling around in the dark. Amen. Amen. And you don't have a clue what you're doing, and you're going to eventually kill yourself. Amen. He knew the power of praise and worship. But the Bible said David danced out his clothes. Praising God. Which comes from gratitude and giving thanks. Do you know that gratitude and thanksgiving is good for your health? Yes, Lord. Yes, it is. Physically and mentally? Yes, Lord. Yes. Amen. Amen. He didn't always feel like it, but he understood that the victory that he was seeking was in his praise. Yes. Amen. The healing was in his praise. Amen. Deliverance was in his praise. Amen. He knew that. We sing the song. You heard this song? Victory's in my praise. Oh, yeah. That's the true song. Amen. It's just more than a song. Not his feelings. Victory wasn't in his feelings mm -hmm. or his fears or his circumstances. His victory was in his praise. praise. Amen. So when we lack praise in God, when we don't want to give God no thanks and hallelujah and raise your hands, see, it's a struggle for you. Mm -hmm. You got to ask yourself the question, why? Why do I sit there and act like God has never done nothing for me? But I can praise and lift my hand, J to the Izzo, E to the E Z, all this crazy stuff for these idol gods. But you won't praise God. That's why you like Amen. I'm telling you something right now. I'm almost close. So it didn't matter what was what came into David's life, he knew how to deal with it. Yes. Amen. This is why in uh, Samuel, 1 Samuel 30, he said he had cursed himself mm -hmm. in the Lord his God. Mm -hmm. While everybody else was crying and having a pity party, mm -hmm. he went to the Lord. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. But in our text, he, that's why he said, make a joyful noise yes. unto the Lord. Amen. All ye land, serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence of singing. <coughs> know ye that the Lord, he is good. Y'all know God is good? Yes. 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 He God, he created us. We didn't create ourselves. Amen. We need to stop acting like we created ourselves. Amen. Amen. Until the wheel fall off. Now we want to act like God created us. Amen. Yeah, like I said, you can hear it. You might not live here. But you'll never be able to go before judgment with God and say you didn't know. He's going to run the whole Amen. sermon back. Amen. Go ahead. You knew. Amen. You just didn't do nothing with it. Oh, yeah. Amen. Amen. It's my job to enlighten you. Amen. Open up the eyes of your understanding. Amen. Because we see with our eyes and we don't have no understanding. Amen. We are his people and the sheep of his pastor. Amen. It says, enter into his gates with thanksgiving Amen. and into his courts with praise. Amen. Be thankful yes. unto him and bless his Amen. name. Amen. 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 Thursday, when you're getting ready to cut that turkey, Lord. I'm going to have me a honey big hand. Amen. <laughs> and you're going to bless it, right? Amen. Amen. It's more than blessing your food. Amen. You need to bless him in everything. The Bible says that everything have breath. Praise the Lord. Amen. Amen. David, like the Apostle Paul, learned four very important things. That God's word is the truth. Yeah. And what they learned was to stick with the script. Yeah. Mm. Amen. They knew the word of God and they kept it. Amen. That's how they got through. Oh, yeah. That's why he was blessed. First Thessalonians 5, 15 through 18. I'm getting ready to close. 15 says, See that none... Render evil for evil unto any man, but every ever follow that which is what? Good. Good. Both among yourselves and to all men. He said, do what's right before everybody. Just do what's right. 
right? Then he says, rejoice evermore. That means don't let the devil steal your joy. Amen. Okay? Don't let the devil steal your joy. He can't do it unless you give it to him. Amen. Amen. Then he says, pray without ceasing. Amen. That means just have a spirit of prayer. Yeah. Spirit of praise. All the time. No matter what you're going through. When things are going along, they be talking, right, on the job. And I be praying. Mm. I be praying in my spirit. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Like, Mike, you don't got to say about it. I say, I'm saying plenty about it. Right, you man. just can't hear. Amen. Oh, I'm talking to the person I need to be talking Amen. to. Y'all talking to each other. Ain't nothing going to get done. Amen. 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 I'm talking to the one that's going to move and make Amen. things happen. Right. Amen. Amen. In everything, verse 18, mm -hmm. give thanks. For this is the will of God Amen. in Christ Jesus concerning you. Amen. That's the command. Amen. Amen. Now, he said, this is the will of God concerning you. Concerning Amen. everybody. This is what I want you to do. Give thanks. In everything. Yes. Amen. Don't murmur and complain. Look, my, my he said my 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 commandments are not grievous. No. Why? He said my commandments are 